pi is overrated as an irrational number. People may not realize this, but there are more irrational numbers than there are rational numbers. And this has nothing to do with their logic. Um, a rational number is one that can be expressed as a ratio of two integers, two-thirds, five-fourths. An irrational number cannot. There are infinitely many rational numbers, but there are uncountably uh, infinitely many irrational numbers. So pi is just one of many, many irrational numbers. Square root of two is an irrational number. Why don't we have the square root of two day? <laughs> Do you celebrate pi day? Do I? No, I would not have even known Pi Day was coming up had Chris not mentioned this. It's much ado about nothing. Now one reason people are familiar with Pi is uh, they know that the circumference of a cir circle is the diameter times this number Pi. So Pi is the ratio of the circumference to the diameter. It has a nice sort of geographical interpretation. That's not so simple for other irrational numbers. And so people have been fascinated with all of the digits that are in this unending representation of pi. Some people have devoted a lot of time to memorizing this. Uh, I think the record is that somebody in China has memorized over 60,000 of the digits in the representation of pi. That's a good way to spend your time. <laughs> The calculation of digits of pi is one way to test the power of supercomputers. So it's not just a nonsensical exercise. There is some madness to this. And there are some beautiful representations of pi that have been developed that have mathematical intrigue. Uh, but for some reason, pi gets its day. We don't celebrate E. And we all know E is a very important irrational number, as is the square root of two and all others. So. Let's, let's give pi its due. <laughs>